Hello! The next few minutes you will find out how much replacing a regular hard drive in your computer with an SSD drive, a solid state drive, speeds up the system. We conducted an experiment and measured the performance of Windows and we can calculate the increase in speed. But first, let's think about hard drive, which it can affect in general. An HDD or SSD is a long-term computer memory. It stores not only your photos, but also files of the Windows operating system, program files. When these programs turn on and work, they read data from their files, and the speed of this process directly affects the speed of the program. First of all, to launch it, files are read from disk, and data is loaded into RAM. If the program accesses a lot of files on the disk, such as programs for video editing, its speed will also change. Let's move on to the experiment. We have a test bench, Toshiba Satellite C50 laptop, with a budget Intel Core i3, simple video card and 8GB of RAM, Windows 10 LTSC 2019, at the moment this system our favorite, Soon will be a video about the experimental comparison of the performance of different versions of Windows. If it already exists, here will be a hint and a link in the description. So, from this experiment we decided to use this edition of Windows 10. And it will be the basis of the current experiment. If you need a license for your Windows or Office at an affordable price, I remind you can find it at the website your laptop link in the description. You will have a normal license, an official Windows, and you no longer need to hack anything and worry about save of your PC, your laptop. The main characters of this video HDD Hitachi and SSD Western Digital Blue. Let's compare them under almost equal conditions, including the Windows operating mode. The first test is speed. HD shows the speed of 117 megabytes per second on a large file and 147 on a small file. Record 116. SSD read 559, write 537, almost 5 times more of 500%. At work with small files of 4 kilobytes, the difference is even brighter. In the first test on 1GB, the HDD reads and writes at a speed of 0.8 and 0.4 MB per second, and the SSD reads 428 and writes 341 and 48. If you calculate this, increase from 7000 to 54000 percent. And in the work of programs and windows, just small files play a role. In the 16 MB test, results are similar. SSD reads and writes information much faster. The second test is running Windows. Note the time taken for the system to start. Both windows on both drives are configured identically and all programs are removed from startup. We will count the time from the appearance of the logo to the full launch of the browser. I will start it as soon as it becomes possible, and how it opens will show that the Windows was wound up and is ready to work. For the purity of the experiment, I will conduct it several times and take the minimum launch time. Windows can use some launches for its updates or settings, so sometimes it happens longer or faster. Write in the comments how many seconds your PC turns on and what kind of system and hard drive you have. Here we go. 3, 2, 1, start. SSD is already at the finish line with a record time of 17 seconds. HDD also loads Windows files, drivers, starts services, and with all this you also need to launch a browser that loads a lot of small files. 
62 seconds is the best time of my situation. Perhaps you are much faster, but my video card driver takes a very long time to load. A few seconds from this time go only to it. On SSD there is no such delay. The result of the experiment is an acceleration of Windows loading by 364%. The third experiment is the starting of a program that pulls a lot of files. I have one, GIMP, a free analog of Photoshop. At startup it pulls into memory many different libraries, fonts, which takes a lot of time. How much will the acceleration with the SSD drive? The experimental conditions are the same as with the launch of Windows, but now we run the GIMP program. Ready, steady, go! SSD here breaks Usain Bolt's record with the best time of 7 seconds. HDD has a hard time with a lot of small files. Remember, in this it is hundreds of times slower. Its best time in this test is 29 seconds. Conclusion: SSD gave an increase to the launch speed of GIMP 414%. Pay attention to our results. Acceleration with SSD is measured in hundreds of percent. Work with files go to a new level. Let's do some more tests. Set up a benchmark for the system and evaluate whether the performance with different hard drives changes. We prepared these benchmarks for a video about comparing the speeds of different windows, 7, 8 and different editions of 10. Here is a tip with a link to this unique experiment as soon as it is published. But for now, subscribe to the PC No Problem channel and click on the bell to not miss such important videos. The benchmark that we used is a 3D mark for testing graphics and processor in games. What do you think? The SSD somehow influenced this? Let's make several runs with benchmarks on each system and get the answer. There are test results on the hand drive and solid state drive. Yes, nothing has changed. And it should not have been. After all, these benchmarks test purely the processor and video card, without touching the disk. Does this mean that SSD does not speed up the game? Of course not. After all, a game is a program that uses its files, creates temporary files in the process, uses a web file, which also lies on the drive. Therefore, installing SSD will definitely speed up your games, and especially their launch. If you are interested in arranging a similar experiment on speeding games, this video should collect enough likes. So we are waiting for your reaction and feedback. Write the comments, share this video with your friends at social networks. This will support the channel and show that you are interested in such experiments. What can we conclude? SSD speeds up the loading of Windows programs working with them by hundreds of percent and copying files even more. The transition to SSD will give a noticeable increase in productivity in working at the computer. If the transition is from already clogged Windows to a new SSD and a new flashly installed Windows, then the increase in productivity can already be measured in thousands of percent. Subscribe and watch other videos on PCNP channel there will be many video lessons on working with a computer and various programs. Useful content for you. See you on there!